Okay guys, check this out. We have another loom. This is another one of the wife's ants. And she's doing, if you didn't see the, the last video on the loom, similar to this, this one is a different color. Different color pattern. Same idea. Very cool, man. Very, very cool. <laughs> but this one is in a total different setting. She's got spectators all day long. Check that out. <laughs> She's got two big mama pigs. There's a garden right there. That's her husband. They got a they got a big garden planted here. It's just getting going. Not much yet, just transplants mostly. And this is taro. That's here all the time. But let's go back and check out the loom. Mama pig tried to bite my foot. That's cool. I did a video on the loom in uh, Bali once, and uh, there they were making silk twice as wide. Same idea. The loom was a little more complicated, and uh, the the bobbin part with the pink thread in it that she has here that she pushes through every time. That was automatic. That went through by itself. So it was a lot quicker. That part right there. Cool. Hi, hi, hi. What's wrong with you, Mama Pig? She don't like me, that's for sure. That is cool, man. Oh, relax, piggy. <laughs> that pig don't like me at all. <laughs> she's almost done too, but she's a lot further behind. You see the the yellow string. You see the yellow string it goes all the way down around here, back up over the top. And it's tied off here. That's the end of her mat right there when that's done. Oh no, it goes over into the bag too. Oh, she's got a lot of work left. <laughs> she's got another week. It's an insane amount of work, let me tell you. I tell you what. But look at that, huh? When it's done, it's beautiful. You see the, the green thread pattern in there, huh? How cool is that, huh? And that's all controlled right there. Oh, she's going to adjust something. Very cool. Look at that. It's almost mesmerizing when you look at it. Oh, something is not quite the way she wants it. Look at that, huh? I think this one is better looking than the, the other ant has. Even though it's just one color thread, the pattern on it is really cool. She's not impressed with me, that's for sure. What did I do? <laughs> Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> You're not very nice, are you? <laughs> okay, pigs, be quiet. <laughs> She's still watching me. What did I do to you? 
<laughs> I love be about all them. for a break. Mm. All right guys, well I guess that's it. I think this is really cool. I don't have the patience for this, that's for sure, but the end result is pretty amazing and they last for years. If you don't keep them out in the sun, look at that. That pig is... Uh, why? Why? Why don't you like me? <laughs> ah, you want to bite me, don't you, huh? Tugging on my shirt. Okay, from a different angle so the pig can't reach. <laughs> Alright, guys. We'll leave it right here. What are you eating? It looks like frozen milk. I think this is very, very cool. But like I said, I don't have the patience for it. You, know, you gotta sit there for weeks to do this. At least a week. A lot of work. A lot of painstaking. Yeah, but that's what all these are. Hours and hours of work. <laughs> Alright guys, as always, thanks for watching. One last look at the pig that's trying to kill me. Look at her. She's still trying to get at me. <laughs> Check this place out, huh? All the comforts of home when you're not at home. And there's one of these mats that she's probably made. It's a different style. And then here's all the reeds, they just haven't been dyed yet, you know? I'm not going to get them back in there. <laughs> They're dry and ready to use. Look at that, huh? No, they're right. 